Hi, my name is Ryan and I'm a lawyer based in Singapore. Last year, I passed the New York Bar exam and I've done a video on the overall approach I took in preparing for this exam. In this video, I'm going to focus on the MBE of the New York Bar exam. So this stands for the Multi-State Bar Exam and involves 200 multiple choice questions you have to complete in six hours. Typically, you do this in two sittings of three hours each and you have to finish 100 questions each time. So here are some tips and strategies that I'd recommend when you prepare for the MBE to put yourself in the best position to succeed. The first thing you need to know is that time management is the most critical thing that you should focus on in your preparation. You're given six hours to do 200 questions, and that equates to about one minute and 48 seconds per question. When you factor in the time you should cater at the end of your exam to cover questions that you may not have gotten the answer to initially, that narrows it down even further. So as a starting point, I think you should cater one minute and 30 seconds for each question and have this at the back of your head as you approach your preparation. The most critical factor I found that helped me most in addressing each multiple choice question was to understand that each question is designed to test the candidate on spotting, identifying, and analyzing the legal issue at hand. So each question of the MBE will be framed as a hypothetical. And based on the facts that you have, you need to identify the issue that's being tested. And in my experience, that was the best ingredient to then determine which answer was most relevant or appropriate to the question. So as you cover all the material, all seven subjects that are tested in the MBE, know that it's about issue spotting, and if you can ingrain that at the back of your head whenever you approach each question, and while you're doing your revision, that will help you very much while taking each question as they come. Next, let's talk about how you should structure your practice sessions leading up to the MBE. So initially, I think you should start by doing questions in small volumes. You're going to have to do 100 questions at one go on exam day. So as a starting point, start by doing 20 questions in the allocated time, then 50 and eventually move to 100. You want to be very, very comfortable with doing the questions that you can within that short amount of time. Because when it all compounds over the course of six hours, it's an incredibly intense experience that you're going to go through. So as I said earlier, time management is key and being comfortable with doing every multiple choice question within the allocated time that you've set for yourself is going to be very important for you to do well in the MBE. My last tip is on exam day, it's important to have a flagging system or a system that you bring into the exam to deal with questions that you don't know the answer to on the spot. There are 200 questions that you're going to have to do in the bar exam. And chances are you won't know the answer to every single question that you approach for the first time. There are many competing factors at play. The clock is ticking. You're trying to recall something from your memory that you may not get the answer to instantly. And with all of the stresses that are associated with you doing so many questions in such a short space of time, it's very important to have the discipline to carry on and address that question later as part of your overall exam approach. So it's important to have a system for yourself that works. For me, I made it a point that after I hit the 1 minute 30 second mark, if I didn't know the answer to that question at that point of time, I flagged it and I tackle it later on. So in terms of timing, decide for yourself how much time you're going to allocate to each question such that you have some buffer at the end of the exam after you've covered all the questions that you know the answers to where you can revisit these flagged questions later on. This really helped me and I think you'll find it very helpful to bring such a system into the exam day and it'll help you tackle these questions that are unclear initially and it'll give you the, the breathing space and the time to address them later on without being too pressurized by the conditions of the exam. So to recap, for the MBE, my three tips are first, to focus on spotting the issue in each question. And that should form the basis of how you approach all the material that you're going to study. Second, time management. Be very precise about how much time you're going to allocate for each question and do as much practice as you can to be familiar with the exam conditions and to pick 
the best answer out of the four options given in a very short amount of time. And third, on exam day, develop a system for yourself to deal with questions that you may not get the answer to immediately so that you can revisit them later on without feeling unnecessarily pressured or stressed because of the clock that's ticking. I wish you all the best and I hope this was helpful in your preparation for the MBE.